Welcome back to my channel, English with Teacher for Internet. Today, I'll be discussing about the origin of the drama in England. And I will also talk about the miracle and mystery plays. And I will be discussing about the various types of drama which was written in the older Greek and apart from that I'll be also talking about the fact that how the university wits they set the ground for William Shakespeare and how he consolidated his uh, stature as a greatest dramatist of all time. If I talk about the miracle and mystery plays, uh, biblical plays were called mysteries and those dealing with saints life were called miracles origin of drama western theater was born in athens greece diatrum choric hymn the chant was introduced by mimic gesture and if i talk about the greek theater rites of dionysus evolved into theater in about 600 bc arian of melhemo corinth wrote down formal lyrics of diatrum Later, Thespis of Attica added an actor who interacted with Chorus. The actor was called protagonist of drama. The word theatre derives from theatron, Greek word which referred to the wooden spectacle stand erected on hillsides. So this is very very important. Uh, sometime UGCnet or NTNet asked this question about the origin of the drama or origin of the poetry and from which word the word drama or poetry has been created. Orchestra is derived from Greek word theatron which referred to wooden spectator. Around 484 BC appeared on the Athenian theatre scene a playwright named Aeschylus. He introduced props and scenery and reduce a chorus from 50 to 12. Aeschylus Persians written in 472 BC is earliest play in existence. Uh, this is just good to go know information that when the uh, first earliest play came into existence, Aeschylus is known as the father of tragedy which is again uh, a good to know information. Prometheus Bound is an unforgettable work as theme was God itself. Agamemnon was one of his plays. Next, in the classical playwright, I'll be talking about Sophocles. He added actors and drama. An emphasis on drama between humans rather than humans and God. Sophocles was first writer to have used comic details in his plays, tragedies. He is the master of device of tragic suspense and tragic irony of which Oedipus the king is supreme example. Euripides is credited with adding to the dramatic form the prologue which set the stage at the beginning of the play. Now, I'll be talking about the divisions of the Greek comedy. It was divided into two parts, the old comedy by Cratinus and Aristophanes and new comedy was further written by Meander and some famous example of the old comedy is the Banqueters, the Babylonians, Lost Comedies. The Arcadians is world first anti-war comedy. This, this could be asked in internet that which was the first anti-war comedy so it was Archangels. Now I'll be talking about some detail uh, about the mystery and miracle. Serious and comic ele elements were interwoven. Morality is serious and interlude is comic. So interlude is can be understood uh, in a way that a comical scene between the tragedy can be you know defined as an interlude. 
In 1576, first theatre was built. Drama period wise can be classified into broad categories as follows. First category is the classic theatre, which is Greek and Roman. Second is the native drama, which was uh, written between 10,066 to 1500. And then Renaissance drama, which was written between 1500 to 1600. Elizabethan drama, Shakespeare and contemporaries, Jacobian and Caroline. Neoclassical or restoration drama and drama in 18th, 19th, and 20th century. So that's the division of the drama which started actually in England from the Elizabethan age, which goes back to Jacobian and Caroline age. The neoclassical or restoration drama, where we can see that uh, William Wisherley and uh, the, the play like Country Wife and those kind of comedies were written. And drama in the 18th and 19th century and 20th century. The stage of 19th and 20th century is called proscenium stage. Little theatre movement. The term is applied to a series of effort in North America, the British Isle and Europe to encourage writing and production of significantly plays as opposed to more highly commercialized production. So these literary terms are very very important. Uh, so you might pause this video and write down the definition of little theatre moment uh, and then I will be talking about tableau, a stationary silent grouping of performance in the theatrical production for a special effects. Now I will be talking about the dramatic structure. The plot, Aristotle termed it mythos. Henry James said that what is character, the determination of incident what is incident but illustration of characters. German critic Gustav Freytag introduced the analysis of plot Freytag's pyramid. Differentiation between act and scene. The curtain falls only after the acts end and scene can change just by dimming of light. Intermission is usually between acts. So these are some technical you know, definitions of the drama and anybody who has uh, interest in knowing more about the drama so these definition could be very very helpful a scene is an independent unit marked by the antiquity of action without any change of place or break in the time next term is poetic justice the term was introduced by thomas ryan uh, it could be very very important that who gave the word poetic justice it was given by thomas Rhymer signifies the destruction of rewards and punishment in proportion to virtue or vice at the end of literary work which must be governed by ideal principle of decorum and morality. Close a drama, a play written to be read rather than performed. Also plays intended to be performed but survived as literature rather than theatre. Silicomythia, a dialogue consisting of single lines spoken alternatively by two characters usually using a verbal duel. Now I'll be talking about the kinds of tragedy. First is the revenge tragedy which derives from the Seneca. Next one is the domestic tragedy written in prose and presented a protagonist from middle or social ranks. Example George Lelos, the London merchant. Aladice Nicole described three techniques of comedy which create a comic detachment. We laugh at the hardship of the characters because the authors see them at psychological distance. Derision, incongruity and automatism. Comedy of manners. Original in New Comedy of Greek, it names implies con concentrates upon the depiction of men and women living in social world rules by convention. Its manner are not simply the behavior of humanity in general, but the affection and culture veneer of highly developed and self-conscious group. So this is the definition of the comedy of manners, comedy of humor, satiric comedy or corrective comedy. Horace Walpole said, life is comedy to those who think and a tragedy to those who feel. Problem play popularized by Norwegian playwright Henrik Ibsen. Uh, this is very, very important that who gave the 
term problem play it was given by the Norwegian playwright Henrik Ibsen now uh, a brief intro about the John Fox book of Matthias first published in English in 1563 John Day the printer who is 1563 had issued the English version of Rerum in Ecclesia Gestarum commentary and acts and monuments popularly known as book of Matthias his Martyrology attempted to outclass the old legend of saint by countering the modern instances of pious solution. Early in mid 16th century, the most important effects of the Judo's reformation was contemporary reformation. Writing was a result of increasing secular as opposed to the devotional phases. And at last, in this lecture, I'll be talking about the literary feature of the age, which is from 1550 to 1630. The neoclassicism, Renaissance strongly felt during Elizabethan reign, uh, revival in the study of Greek in all branches of literature, Greek and Latin uses began to force upon English. Abundance of output, pamphlets and treatises were freely written, literary question became almost of national importance. The new romanticism, romantic quest is for the remote and wonderful and beautiful. There was a daring and resolute spirit of adventures in literary and other region. And next I'll be talking about the drama. It was bold and critical attitude was keeping wits dramatic instinct. Stephen Goswan, a violent school of abuse 1579 to which Sydney replied with apologies for poetry. This is very, very important that in what response the apology for poetry uh, was written by Philip Sidney, it was against the Stephen Goswan's school of abuse and John Bale's King John of 1536 and for information the spelling would be K-Y-N-G John of 1536 is often claimed as the first English drama to be based on national history. This is very very important that the first drama based on English national history was King John. Bale's three laws and plays this, that sins from it, God's promises, John the Baptist. With this, I conclude my lecture on the introduction to the drama and I have discussed about the types of drama in this particular video lecture. Also, I have discussed about